About these people, I mean, I assume that the Washington Post will be apologizing any minute now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I can hardly wait. But the national security, why would people from Yemen be crossing that border? Uh, and it's not, I, just, it's not I, just from Yemen. But what the border agents are telling me are seeing things they've never seen before. So what will happen? Just in this one section of El Paso, they're catching from 100 to 200 people a night. And think how many they're not catching. What they'll rush, the, they'll rush the wall or they'll rush an opening that hasn't been finished in the wall with about 100 people, with women and children. Then they'll take the men to the other section. And what happens is those cartels go to the other section when, when the Border Patrol are working and stretch so thin. And they're saying they're seeing more fentanyl than they've ever seen. They picked up more people than just Yemen. They told us they're on the national terror list, the people they're picking up. And what's the first thing the Democrats said to me? That I was lying. What's the DHS secretary say? He said, oh, it's not a problem. And he literally told the rest of the world, we're not saying don't come, just don't come right now. What does that mean to them? What does it mean when President Biden says, I'll make you all citizens? They'll take that trek for 22 days to try to hurry up and get here. Any President chance you, Biden did you get, has created did, the border. Did you ever get a chance to get in one of the cargo shipping containers where they're storing kids with the one little window with the bars on it? Did you get I didn't a, get that. They I, won't I, let the us in to see them. The facility I got into, you see these children. It, Sean, you and I are both fathers. It will break your heart. And this is what the, these are what some of the agents have told me. What they're seeing now, one agent picked up a one-year-old, a three-year-old, and a five-year-old holding hands. No one in sight for miles, walking by themselves. Why are the children doing this? Why are the parents putting them through this? Because President Biden told them to come and they'll make them citizens. At no time is it right to break the law and come here illegally. We is, believe in legal immigration, but what's happening at the border is more than a crisis. This is a human heartbreak. This is a national security problem. This goes to the heart of what we understand, and only one person has changed to make this happen. President Trump had a secure border.